To access the abdominal cavity, small incisions are created. Trocars are placed to serve as passageways for surgical instruments. The surgeon examines the abdomen using a laparoscope or video camera. The average human stomach can expand to hold around one to one and a half litres of food. While in the stomach, food is combined with digestive enzymes. These help break the food down into a simpler form so that it can be digested more easily and absorbed in the small bowel. The SIDES begins with a sleeve gastrectomy in which a thin vertical sleeve is created using a stapling device. This sleeve will typically hold between 100 and 150 millilitres and is about the size of a banana. The resected portion of the stomach is removed. The small bowel is divided approximately 3 centimetres beyond the stomach, preserving the pylorus. The end of the small bowel is located and about 3 metres of small bowel are measured. At this point, a loop of the small bowel is brought up to the duodenum and joined, as shown. By altering the anatomy of the gastrointestinal tract by creating the gastric sleeve and altering the path and anatomy of the small bowel, the CIDES changes signals in the body, resulting in decreased hunger and increased feelings of fullness after meals.